So at that point, um, I basically stayed home for like the next 30 days and I didn't have any social interaction with my friends and I just sat on my hands and I just pushed towards my goals. And a couple months later, I decided to start specializing in hair extensions. I said, you know what, I gotta do something to make more money and make something of myself. So I took the one thing on my menu that was the most expensive and that I really thought that would push me forward and I can be, become a specialty service. So that's when I changed the name of my business. Um, and I put all of my marketing efforts into hair extensions. So anytime I you know, posted a picture online or anything like that um, on the marketing level, it was all towards hair extensions. Because I figured if I can get somebody in to do hair extensions, they were also going to have me do their cut and color and highlight and all that stuff too, right? Because everybody really wants to go to one specific place to have everything done. So at that point, I started doing hair extensions. And not to, like probably within the next two years, I became the top producer at the salon, and I'm sure I was making more than the owner. 